Hey, thanks so much for being here. Don't forget to hit subscribe and hit like if you like these types of videos. Hey, are you trying to reduce sodium and salt from your diet? Maybe not reaching for that salt shaker as often? Maybe you just had a visit with your doctor and discovered your blood pressure was high and he said to reduce salt from your diet. Maybe he even gave you one of those looks. You know the one. Or maybe you stand on the scale and you notice after a salty meal that dreaded water weight. Maybe you're trying to reduce sodium, but you find your food boring, bland, dull. Well, let me give you a recipe to spice everything up and you won't miss the salt at all. Okay guys, so let's get started with our salt-free seasoning. Let me tell you, this will pack a flavor punch. So you will need one tablespoon of dry mustard. I actually used this Keen's dry mustard. Any dry mustard will do. One tablespoon of paprika. One tablespoon of onion powder. One tablespoon of garlic powder. One and a half teaspoons of black pepper. Now I just used the this black pepper. You can, you know, grind it yourself if you want a little bit more of a a punch. One teaspoon of thyme and one teaspoon of basil. Then you're gonna want to dump it all into a bowl and you're gonna want to whip You want to get all that mustard, paprika, garlic, all those tasty things mixed in together, nice and incorporated. You could use this on scrambled eggs. You could use, rub this on chicken. You can rub it on beef. You could use it for anything, really. Instead of reaching for the salt shaker, just you could put this in a little shaker container if you wanted to but it's probably best to store it in an airtight container and it's good to go you could grab this spice you know if you think your food's a little blah and that's it guys it's a salt free seasoning blend delicious help keep your sodium down if you're on dialysis help keep that fluid off you and i appreciate you guys for watching and i'll talk to you later bye now